All right, Emily, we're in the orchids down here at Joplin oh, Greenhouse. Yeah. Now, these scare the heck out of me to do that. I think they scare the heck out of a lot of people. Tell me, they should do. I take an orchid home or not? Yes, please take an orchid home. They're wonderful little blooming plants for anywhere inside your house that has bright indirect light. And a lot of people are intimidated by these plants because they can't seem to keep them alive. But really, they're kind of low maintenance if, if you know uh, a few points on what to do. So I'm gonna share them with you. All right. One, brightest indirect light you have is what they prefer. The brighter the light, as long as it's not direct sunlight, they will keep their blooms on for a month to three months on the longer end. And you have to plant them in sphagnum moss or orchid bark. You cannot plant these guys in regular soil because they are a part of the epiphyte family, which is basically like how a barnacle is to a boat. These guys in their natural environment, they will attach themselves onto trees with their beautiful jade green roots. And then the third tip is to use a specific orchid fertilizer at fourth strength for the spring and the summer. And that will encourage blooms and it will also help your, keep your blooms on longer. Beautiful. So, and we'll find them down here at the Joplin Greenhouse, right? You will. Thank you, Emily.